New at 6, a slice of Palm Beach County paradise in peril tonight. WPTV's Lenny Spall shows how a West Palm Beach neighborhood is having alarming heaps of trash. Here we have a mini cheeseburgers crafted for schools, Donley Farms. The perils of protecting paradise becoming all too familiar for Ali Ambrosio. This is typical. She picks up trash along the intracoastal waterway each day. There's only one thing that comes in little tiny square ziplocs this size. But over the last few weeks, unwelcome heaps of waste have seeped onto the beach, prompting concerns and confusion throughout her Northwood Harbor neighborhood in West Palm Beach. It's unlike anything that we've seen. Um, you know, we've seen some bad trash here, uh, but usually we can link it up with bad weather. Um, and even so, it's not like what we're seeing now. Ambrosio teamed up with nearby neighbors to clean it up. The amount of trash, overwhelming. Yeah, I've never seen something that is so devastating, honestly, in my lifetime. Neighbors fear the plastic washing up near their homes could be a distress signal from the ocean. The seas are littered with plastics, especially in the Pacific Ocean, where a glob of floating bottles twice the size of Texas keeps growing. They also wonder if a barge in the intracoastal could be a factor, but their calls to the Coast Guard have not been answered. Right in its wake, this trash patch appeared. That trash patch Ambrosio sifted through also showed something dangerous in the sand. This is another syringe that we just found um, washed up in the seaweed. Syringes lining the shoreline. This snapshot shows one with a needle still attached. This beach is literally full of syringes. There's active injecting going on in the park to the south of here and in the empty lot to the north every day. Excessive drug use now paired with an alarming pile of garbage. Their patience to find a solution is wearing thin. We would love to understand what's going on. In West Palm Beach, Lenny Soup Hall, WPTV News Channel 5.